Here is the baby who was born. Here is the boy who was lost and found. Here is the man who was baptized and blessed by God. Here is the man in the desert who turned away from temptation. Here is the man who came close to people no one else wanted to come close to. Here is the man who shared the bread and wine with his friends before being taken by the temple guards. The night was a confusing one. The next day, Jesus was taken outside the walls of the city and crucified. That afternoon, Jesus died. The sky grew dark. Jesus was taken down from the cross and buried in a cave. A great stone was rolled into the opening of the cave to close it like a door. Saturday was so quiet, you could almost hear the earth breathing. On Sunday, it was the women who had the courage to go to the tomb just to be close to Jesus. They wanted to remember everything, even if it was sad. When they came to the tomb, they found that the stone had been rolled back and that the tomb was empty. Jesus had died on the cross, but somehow he was still with them as he is with us, especially in the bread and the wine. When you look at this side, you know that the other side is there. And when you look at this side, you know that this side is there and you cannot pull them apart. This is the mystery of Easter and that makes all the difference. And so the colors change. Wait a minute, there's something wrong. Here's the beginning. The middle. And the end. Look, if we only have this side, the story has an end. But there's also this side. The ending is also a beginning. So we can't leave the story in a line. Let's see what we can do.
now the story can go on forever. Thank you.